Welcome everyone, this is Samsung Galaxy A41 and today I'll show you how to enable the power saving mode. So to get started, let's pull down the notification panel and find the power mode, which is right here for me. Now the position of this icon might vary a bit, so keep that in mind. But once you find it, you can hold it and this will take us to the settings of it where you have a couple additional ways of uh, well, managing your power. When you tap on it by default, I believe it goes into the, the normal one. So yeah, medium power saving mode. And you can see what it does in it. So you have turn on off always on display and limit CPU to 70% plus drop the brightness to, well, uh, drop the brightness by 10%. And uh, normally it would show you also the time that it will save, but apparently it doesn't do it now. But you can apply it from here. Usually it does add a little bit of battery to it. It's nothing mind blowing, it's about like a couple hours. Um, so keep that in mind. Um, let me also disable the dark mode right now. So it looks uh, normal as it would normally do. So you can see that this would be the medium power saving mode, which doesn't do much. Uh, the phone still looks and virtually feels like it's uh, in the normal mode, I would say. And also the power saving that we get from it is negligible. But you also see that there was another mode. If you hold it, you can go to it and you have the maximum power saving mode. And well, this one will give you significantly more battery life. Now, and here it shows you basically the same things as it did before. So turn off always on display, limit CPU to 70 and brightness uh, dropped by 10%. But it also does so much more, which you will see once you tap on apply. And this mode is well designed to be quite a drastic one. So you have the 70% always on display, then restrict background data, limit number of uh, usable apps and dark mode and background location checks. So disable uh, background activities, uh, basically shuts down apps that are inactive and not needed and also removes, as you can see, basically majority of the apps that you would normally have on your screen. So only the most important one are accessible. Also your notification panel is now fairly limited with only the essential toggles in here and well, essential apps here. And if you go into the settings, I believe it's also limited. Yep, there we go. So you don't have much settings in here either. And the dark mode is there just to save the battery even further because of the AMOLED display. It doesn't need to light up the, um, the black areas, only the text and well colors of the icon. So anything that is glowing right now is whatever it needs to light up. And anything, uh, anything that is black is basically rendered, well, turned off. So that will save the battery too. And this will give you a significant amount of battery life. Uh, comparing to the previous one. So this is a case where you are gonna be, I don't know, stranded somewhere. <laughs> this would be a good mode to enable. And to deactivate it, all you need to do is pull down the notification panel, tap on it once more, and it goes back to normal. And there we go. So that is how you would enable and also disable the power saving mode. And if you found this very helpful, don't forget to hit like, subscribe, and thanks for watching.